Speaking of subs, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to, uh, we're going to do some Modern Cube first, because I just want to jump right into it. I love Cube. It's my favorite format. And, uh, so, a little update. Pretty sweet. I got an email last night at, like, I don't know, 2 a.m., 3 a.m., somewhere on there from Twitch, and they were like, they said, what did they say? Let's find out. They said, I've gone ahead and sent you an invitation for our highest tier of contract. Please access by visiting the partner section of your dashboard. You will need to click partner onboarding in order to set the process. From the date of completion, you will receive uh, X percent subscription split across all three. I don't know if I'm supposed to say what the split is. Uh, I guess I guess I can. Brian Kibler said it yesterday on, on, on Facebook, so that's not really a huge... I guess it's not a huge thing. However, we are now uh, the highest tier, which is great. Uh, it is apparently 350 out of out of five instead of 250 out of five, so a dollar, a si significant amount, like it's a dollar more. Um, so, yeah, pretty stoked. I feel like today we can. So yeah, it feels that's it's fantastic. It feels like I just got a promotion. So it's just, it's been awesome. I appreciate all the support you guys have uh, have shown for the past couple months, especially as I've been trying to reach this milestone, and. Um, means a ton thank you guys so much man you guys are awesome and on that note feel free to sub especially because now you know more of your hard-earned dollars will be going towards the content creator and not towards big twitch big twitch i love you you're probably just a globalist chill i am i'm a big twitch globalist chill <laughs> all right we did it we did it A thing happened. Something did happen. CTB, thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back. Welcome back. <clears throat> it's nice to know that all these subs that are happening right now, uh, you get to actually give more to, to me, actually, than Twitch. So that's awesome. So Salty, thank you so much, buddy. Hopefully you've had more burritos since the last time we spoke. And tacos as well, because... <laughs> big twitch formerly known as large spasm that seems that seems much much less inviting in terms of uh streaming services i got like, a large spasm okay well in the back like... <laughs> also did you answer the question about your back oh has it gotten any better no definitely not no I, well he got in here and i was like how's your back today and he's like <clears throat> uh about the same and i was like that's no good are you earning at a higher... I am. I just got an email. You just missed it. How dare you, Gamma Set? How dare you? I'll read it again. Twitch sent me an email last night. It was It's so funny because it was 3.14 a.m. and I happened to be awake. And they were like, hey, I've gone ahead and sent an invitation for a highest tier of contract. And uh, from now on, I get 70% instead of 50% split. So that's pretty insane. Um, yeah, sick. I'm, I'm so stoked. I'm super stoked about it. It feels like all the hard work paid off, you know? It's like a good feeling. It's it's very... Uh, it's rewarding, man. Do you prefer Mike or Michael? Mike's cool. Okay. Um, what happened... The, unfortunately, no, like... he isn't. I didn't, like, lift anything heavy. I didn't, like, fall down. I just woke up and my back was just like... Sorry, we don't work down here anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Did you try asking them nicely? Celebrate good times, Frank Brando. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. Five hundred good times bits. Mike, I'm sadly feeling your pain. That's no good. That's not ideal. Unfortunately, I didn't have have more two more business trips this year to Poland and Russia. I guess. Are there? Is Mexican food just not popular overseas? Like in. Ooh, we got a Doom Whisper up in the cube now. That's exciting. But we also have a Pestermite. Yeah, but is Kiki G is Splinter Twin in the cube? Because it's banned in modern. <clears throat> can someone well, I imagine can... Kiki Jiki's in it. You can just look it up. Can someone look it up for us? I don't feel like investing that kind of effort into this. Actually, it might be on the main page. Hold on, let's find out. Uh, magic on my calendar. Nope. That would be that would be cool, but I kind of just want to take this Doom Whisper. I'm living in Spain and good Mexican food is hard to find. That seems rough then. I thought modern... I, I thought it was as well. However, Third Eye Chion, 
uh, got into the chat and was like, hey, the cube is up now. And I was like, this is not a drill. This is not a drill. The cube is up. Haji Gulashi, gifting us up. Thank you so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. 22 gift subs. That's a reasonable. That's a reasonable amount. <laughs> Doom Whisper. Do I just take the Doom Whisper? No, see, you seem real excited about it. I do because it's new. It's a very strong card. We could just take the uh, Rampaging Ferocidon as well. This Go is also a great red. sword to take. I'm going to take this sword. No, I'm going to take the... Yeah, alright, I took the sword. <laughs> oh, biscuits. This is actually... The sword seems stronger in Modern Cube, and this is... Uh, it's like the best sword, man. It's a pretty good one. Still no still no art on these guys, huh? But there's art on these guys. Oh, Sahili Rai. That's a combo. Maybe there's a little... A little goat man to go with it. Maybe there's a little goat man. A little goat man. <laughs> I have no idea what to pick here. Villy, you'll be pleased to know that uh, Twitch sent... I'm going to say it a million times, I'm sure, as people join us. Uh, I got an email last night from Twitch, and they were like, <coughs> hey, here's a contract for the highest tier... Uh, what does it say? Partner rate? Highest tier contract. And now I, I get... I, I did it. We did it, boys. Is it Inferno Titan? Inferno Titan's pretty good. So is Geist. What a tireless tracker. That guy's good too, right? Mm. You don't like a tireless tracker? Not over an Inferno Titan. I don't like red, though. Why not? I don't know. I'm a redist. I took the red card. What makes the red card red? It's mana cost. <laughs> Ooh, find finalities in the cube now. Alright, it's going to take a little bit to get my bearings straight in this cube. This is interesting. There's also a wooded, wooded foothills and a woodland cemetery in the last pack, which is worth noting, because if we go Jund, we can see those back. So we got Atarka, we got Phyrexian Metamorph, we got Shriek Mao, and Choppy. Chapacabra. Choppy. Chapacabra. This is a little choppy. I wish this was a dog horror instead of a beast horror. It's clearly a hound, right? It's a dog. I think it's important to make the distinction in magic between dogs and beasts because if you if you condense them like that, it's let's just... go black red good stuff. Thank you, Frogler with the resub. Thanks so much, buddy. Really appreciate it. We did do it. Super stoked. How about this, right? It's this. It's metamorph, right? I mean, even if we take one of these black cards, it's still a metamorph, right? I don't know. I was I was chooping. I was ready for that choop. Well, isn't this a choop? Maybe. <laughs> well, there you go. There you go. 200. We did it, Bugs. Oh, Billy. Really? <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, Billy. <laughs> How many is that? That's a uh, total 74. Okay. That's reasonable. Yeah, that's a reasonable amount. Billy, you are amazing, dude. I don't understand, but. I don't know what the pick is here. I can't concentrate now. This seems pretty good. I, I agree. I agree. Thank you. Yep. Ten thank yous incoming. <sighs> oh, man. You. you are the best, dude. And, oh, oh, man. I like a Torrential Gear Elk a lot. Do I like it in this cube, though? I don't know. I don't, know we, I don't have any targets for Ooh, it. We got a Knight of Autumn. Just saying. I'm not saying it's a pick. I'm just pointing it out. <clears throat> Oracle of Moldiah, Staff thank of Nin. Oracle of Molly Dully. You, you know I like an Oracle of Molly Dully. Who doesn't? Some people don't. Thank you. I imagine there's some people don't. <laughs> what are you guys doing? Thank you. <laughs> are you guys having a sub off right now? Neon Tokyo Rain. Thank you so much, buddy. Ten more gifted <clears throat> subs. Wow, okay. This is nice. Thank you. Oh, boy. Well... <sighs> So much thank you. I'm starting to believe I'm single-handedly supported by about two or three people in this stream. <laughs> it's like, look, let's just gift him a total of 500 subs over the course of a couple months. It'll be fine. Thank you. I kind of want to be open for black, too, because I think there's some good black cards coming around. And I don't really care about either of these. Uh, maybe it's Farseek, actually. Farseek's pretty good. I will do like a Farseek. 
Oh, Beast Whisperer. All right, so we're seeing some. Oh, Teferi Mage. Oh, that's a that's regular Teferi. It's just new art. Never mind. Mm. I do like that though. I'm sorry. What's going on now? No, Hajigalashi. <laughs> God. Twenty-seven. Jeez. No, that's twenty-seven total. It's five oh. right now. But like, nonetheless, you guys are insane. Well, I think we're over five hundred again. That should make the Twitch gods happy. What do we take here, man? I need you to focus on this because I'm having oh. a hard time concentrating. Here. Um, search for tomorrow seems good here. Thank you. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. Oh. What the hell is exclusion mage? Exclu it's just an Aether, Aether Adept. Oh, okay. You know what Aether Adept is? Yeah. Thank okay. You. I think you take it, actually. Really? <laughs> I feel like... I think you take it. Well, over what? I, like, steal it 5-4 for 3? That's really hard to cast. Oh, man. Billy, thank you so much, buddy. Again, I don't even know how to, like, respond to these things. Thank you. <sighs> Why did I take Geralt's Messenger? Oh, my God. Oh, well, Doom Whisper came back. Is this really that? This is a 6-6 six, six flyer. It's the modern cube, guys. It's not the vintage cube. Take it. I will Thank take it. You. Oh, Woodland Cemetery. All right. Or, do we want the Garrick? We can get other Garricks. <laughs> There's other Garrick. Wow, that's so... That's so. That makes him feel so unspecial, right? Like, there's other Garricks. You're easily replaceable. You. Yeah, I like the fixing. Oh, I was hoping this came back. All right, maybe we're not red. Thank you. Eh, you never know. The overrun dream could be alive. You never know, actually. That's a good point. That's what I was thinking. Thank you. This guy's fine. It blocks early, guys. It hits your lands. Are we living that Grey Thank Merchant you. dream? No. I'll take the sword. Now right. we have a sword to board You're into. You're in the deck. <clears throat> what was our mistake Thank pick? The stupid Dross Messenger? Man, we could have totally had that Steel Leaf Champion. What am I missing? An anonymous user is gifting five subs? I don't even know who that is. What? That's the point. I guess that is the point, huh? Thank you. Oh my god, you guys are amazing. I don't even know what's happening right now. <clears throat> it's the first modern cube draft in the first seven minutes of the draft. <laughs> you two, we all thank you. <laughs> yeah, I uh there's also been miss picks due to the due to the overwhelming appreciation and thank yous that I, I feel right now, so that's a thing. We got a Primus boy. We got a, a crocodile. Oh, this is a new one. I'm sorry, are we still cubing? I forgot. <clears throat> I'm just waiting for the sub gold update. I don't know what the pick is here. I haven't known what the pick is in this entire draft so far. Cygnus seems. Decent. Safe over Primus though. Primus is so strong. It's triple green though. He might be able. I don't think so, man. All right. I just want Primus. You ever heard Primus, man? That's a good band. Udama. <laughs> that's a, that's Primus a solid. Primus is name. an interesting band. Oh look, we can take either of these Sultai lands, and then we're just we're good to go. G two G. Also, Hero's Downfall is solid. Null Hide Ferox in the cube now. Worth noting. I like these new, these new uh, Guilds of Ravnica editions. It's gotta be heroes now. I like it. these new Guilds of Ravnica editions. Oh. Sarah, thank you so much for the resub. Really appreciate it. You are the best. Thirteen best colors in Magic months. I don't know if that makes any sense, but you know what? I'll give it to you. I'll give it to you. I like an overgrown tomb. Yeah, it seems pretty good. I mean, as a oh boy, but there's there's a no. We're never casting that card. Get out of here. I like that Mike is the voice of reason in this draft. I don't know when that happened, but... <laughs> He's Quad like, no black. Steel Leaf Champions, no Phyrexian Obliterators. Wow, you guys are insane. Thank you so much. Holy smokes. I'm sad I can't sub now. I mean, I'm already sub. You'll be all right. Josh, tell you what. You resub, we're good to go. <clears throat> Mike has always been the voice of reason in my heart. 
That's like that's a really good Valentine. I should have taken Steel Leaf instead of Giraffe's Messenger, which was an accidental pick. After watching you freeze on YouTube, according to the conclusion, Mike isn't your son. Appreciate it. Good good observation. The mystery has been solved. <laughs> Solid detective work. It's either Bailoth or Skin Render, and I, I only say that because those are the two black and green cards in the pack. This is kind of weird. Is this a new addition? I think Bale for table. I don't think Skin Render will. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. There's only five. I don't think so. Four cards are coming back. I don't think Bailoff's going to be one of them. Do you want the Skin Render? Yeah, I do. <laughs> yeah, I do. <clears throat> All right, I took it. Ooh. Oh, we could have had it. Also, ooh. Oh, that's pretty good. Yeah, that's, that's very that's good. Pick. Also, there's a Mask Arm and a Thrag Tusk in here. All right, well, we're in the... I want to say we're in the right colors, but... All right, we'll take this guy, though. Belschnickel over Cultivate? Yeah, we already have a Far Seek and a Search and a Nissa that gets us land and or We have a ton of ways to get mana. I want some high end. Some high end boys, and I, I'm a big Belschnickel fan. Yeah. Mind Shatter seems real strong. Also, Blooming Marsh. What happened here? I mean, are there serious questions, though. Can I decline this gift and pass it off to someone else and just do their prime stuff? Otherwise, I don't know what to do with it this month and I'll go to waste. I don't think so. I decline this sub. You gotta find someone else to support. Yeah, gift it. Go, go, give. Uh, go give like. Go give someone else your support. Cube went up, and none of my favorite streamers were playing. I was so con. Hey, buddy, listen, I'm right here. What did you say? What is the pick? Give me the pick. Blooming Marsh. Over Mind Shatter. This is random, you know. Oh. Let's do that. All right. Yeah, it's it's like if it wasn't random, I would be on your on board. But once I learned it was it was random, like not learned, but like remembered it was random, I was like, oh, that's really good. We got a slaughter pact. We got a life bane zombie. I think it's just two drop. We don't have any two drops. What does right that guy now. even do? It's a two three for two, and whenever it's a target of spell or ability, you make a one one. Okay. And you can pump it later in the game. All right. Okay. Okay. Excuse me. We got a night veil specky. We're not casting cast, that. Though. Yeah. We got a frexian arena, and that's, we got a we got okay. a crocodile we could try out. Fuck. <laughs> that is a crocodile. Five five. Whenever they cast a spell, it gets a negative one, negative one counter. But whenever it deals combat damage to a player, you remove all the counters from it. I don't know. I'm probably just take for take arena, right? Yeah. Also, it's a blackboard arena, so good on you, wizards. Good on you. It's the arena. It only gets green permanence, right? Uh, no. You put any non-land permanent one for us. Mana costs X or less from them among them. Can we play that? Maybe. Why even maybe? Okay, I don't know, buddy. You don't have to be so aggressive about this. Well. Okay, the next pack is going to be the uh, the Rampaging Bailoth pack, so we're going to find out. You ready? Yeah. Dang it. Didn't think so. No one took the Chain Whirly Boy? Oh, Masker Worm came back, though. That's a card worth triple. That's a playable boy. An anonymous user is getting five subs? What is even going on? What is even happening? Thank you. This is crazy. Anonymous user, thank you so much. I don't know who you are, but... Thank you. You'll be in my heart. Thank you. Thank you. And now, my friends, the coffee is gone. Oh, that's interesting. I don't think we're playing it, though. No. <clears throat> it is amazing how committed you are to salt i'm not even it's this wasn't even intentional this is just a we just actually i mean we started getting pass cards uh in these colors so it just kind of worked out <clears throat> plus we got the two lands which is nice and we got a duel for our far seat which is super nice. Yeah, I actually... I was real thrilled about that, actually. Oh, Simic Signet? Do we just do we just go full on Sultai now? No. <laughs> no. Shh. Ultimate Price? Sure. I don't think it's Tooth and Nail. I don't think we're a Tooth and Nail deck. No. Although we do have some big boys. Yeah, but we're just kind of valuing Tooth and Nail, which I don't know how much that's good. Right, you kind of want to be like, well, Emrakul Pro Progenitus. I guess we'll just take a little price here.
They can't win if we kill all their dudes. Oh, look at Silumgar's command. That's a new one in here. Look how creepy he looks in this, too. Hey. Is it just Liliana? I mean, it's like the most powerful card in here. We could take Windswept Teeth, but I think Liliana might be better. I think yeah. this is going to be stronger in this cube. Especially if we can get these guys in the graveyard. Does it let you get from only your graveyard or any graveyard? Uh, any uh, your graveyard. Okay. Uh, I like a batter skull. Oh, I like this Nissa as well. Oh, I like a slime boy slime as well. God. <clears throat> I think slime boy is the most versatile here. Versatile. We also don't have an effect like that. Hmm. We could also Phyrexian metamorph our slime boy and then reanimate our slime boy. That's a lot of slime boys. Gotta go take my final team call before Thanksgiving. Billy, enjoy your team call, buddy. Don't let Mike get back into rat. He's still in rat dead. He hasn't gotten out of his rat dead yet. You don't know that. Have you? No. <laughs> Nailed it. Oh. I don't think we're a crater hoof deck, though. Sure we, we are. are a Maelstrom Pulse deck, though. We have 11 creatures. Oh, yeah, good point. But no, you're right. We're not really I think we're Maelstrom deck. Pulsing. Yeah. Having Maelstrom Pulse and Assassin's Trophy seems pretty good. And Abrupt Decay. We'll just have all the good green-black removal. Our removal suite is really nice right now. And this is a sweeper, but it also acts as like a draw too, which is insane. Like, I think Fine Finality is very, very good. Do we need Abrupt Decay? Probably not. I mean, what else would we take, though? Like Rampant Growth. Do we need Rampant Growth? Maybe not. What are the new cards added to Modern Cube this time? Um, like we showed you, we've seen a bunch. What Maybe about Lotus Reaper. Cobra? What? What about Lotus Cobra? It's all right. We don't need fetch lands or anything. It's just basically it a, a solid two drop. Can kill, it's a though. solid two drop though. Like, so is Rampant Growth. Yeah, but that guy attacks and blocks. I mean, it also gets killed, so you don't get the ramp at all. But also, quote swords. See, that's a that's a better argument. Yeah. All right, that one sold me. You had me with swords. Oh man, look, two more. Oh, Ruinous Path too. Butter my biscuits. Fertilid Ground. That's your favorite one. Fertilid Dirtilid. Oh, yeah. We got this Assassin's Trophy right here. We also have a, a Doom Whisperer right here. Oh, we can Doom Whisperer and put things in the graveyard with Surveil and then Liliana's Mastery. Yeah, you're right. What is going on? This Anonymous user donated donated five more subs? What is even happening right now? Thank you. It's your secret Santa. <laughs> it is my secret Santa. Tonos isn't in the chat, right? Tonos would never do it anonymously, though. Thank you. That's super fascinating. An honest, a random anonymous person. Thank you so much. Really appreciate it. You are. Thank you. You are. Gear Hulk. You are Gear Hulk. It's also beast within, but I think Gear Hulk's a little better. I like Gear Hulk and replacing Masquerum with it. I think Masquerum is great, but I don't think it's main deck in the modern cube, at least. That's fair. Yeah, I like Gear Hulk. Look, there is the the horn boy. Yeah, of course. Not gonna have one without the other. Sahili's terrible by itself. The funny thing is, we could have actually gotten it now. Wow, we're at like I don't even know how many subs we're at right now. We could have had both a Kijiki Kijiki combo, a Kijiki Kijiki combo, mm -hmm. and the <clears throat> oh, we could have actually Sahili had both. Combo. Yeah, you're right. I'm gonna take this Westvale Abbey because I think it's playable. Oh wow, no respect. That uh, sh sh Elves Deep Shadow is pretty good though. It's not bad. I'll take it. It also can wear a sword. A sword. An S word. Uh, kind of a non-creature spell. Return of permanence. Yeah, I'll take this, actually. If we end up finding... Oh, the Nissa came back? What in the earth, man? We are the only, like, green drafter at this table, I think. Yeah. But yeah. No, the Farseek didn't come back. All right, so we got three cuts to make, unfortunately. Take the tooth! Uh, Kajiki Jiki. Yeah, that's a classic. <clears throat> My god. I wish I, I can't, like, I feel like I can't thank this anonymous person appropriately. 
man, oh man. Good times. He has been great. What a day. What a glorious day. So what does that Nissa do again? What? Makes a 4-4, untaps four forests, or you search your library for any number of basics, put them into play, and then shuffle your library. They become 4-4s. Four Pretty good. Forever. Forever 4-4s. Four so that thing is neg four, neg four to all creatures, and one of and you can put two counters on a one on a on a creature. Okay. So if you have a three three, you can put two counters on it, make it a five five, and then kill everything else. Oh, you can cast both halves. No, but that's the same. That's the same half. You put two one one counters on a creature, then all creatures. Oh, neg four, neg four. the other one is a return a creature card from your graveyard hand. Okay. Oh, uh, the other one's return two creature cards from your graveyard hand. That's pretty good. You have no idea what this card does. Nope. Well, now you know, I guess. Now you know. I'll take the Green Seeker out. Yeah, I can see that. Two more cuts. Two more cuts. What if we want all the cards? Maybe Liliana. Yeah, she's not that impressive. We also have Fine Finale to get two dudes back. One more cut. Or. 16 lands? Yeah, we have a lot of Accelerant. I think we could do 16 lands here. You don't want to play that Abbey? I don't, not not if we're playing 16 lands, I don't think. We have some pretty high color requirements. This is 9-8. Or 9-9. Nine, 9-9. Nine. Nine, nine. Okay. Let's do it. If you can make a dude live through Fine Finality, and if you can also kill all of their dudes with Fine Finality, it's pretty good. Cheshire Pratt, I'm not sure if you meant you you needed a comma in your sentence. You could be saying, no way, this is a 17 land deck. Or you could be saying, no way, this is a 17 land deck. Those are two completely similar... Uh, those are two completely different different meanings with two completely similar writings. I'm going to keep this hand. Yeah, what is a Rainbow Lich deck? Keep it's the deck Ollie and trazi has been championing. Man, they lead on Celestial What Kong. makes it a Rainbow Lich? Uh, because it's five colors and it plays Blitch's Mastery. Oh, that's I've seen a girl, she's the first girl who said cool when I told her about MTG and she came to F. That's awesome, dude. Congrats. Better ultimate price, I think. The wall? Yeah, man. Um, You know what? I'll take it under advisement. Okay. I mean, how can you attack if he has a wall? Yeah, that's a good point. Oh, that's worse. I don't know how to deal with that. Just don't have anything to die. Assassin's Trophy. Thank you. Dang it. Harmon, thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back. Today's a good day to get those resubs in because higher tier. I don't want them to kill this Nissa and then keep getting Nissas back. I guess they can't flip They're it. Blue and white. They... Yeah. They're gonna kill it. Well, they well they can Day of Judgment, I guess. <clears throat> they want a Day of Judgment. That's fine. Oh, that's better. Oh, all right. Well, that's a thing, I guess. I don't want them to put the wall under here either, I I guess. That's not so bad. It's not so bad. Dang it. I mean, ideally, we're going to just make them discard their whole hand next turn. <laughs> Hugh, 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 Hugh. Oh, boy. Next turn, we could have actually flipped Nissa and made them discard their whole hand. So that's... That's nice. <clears throat> Lafof, what's going on, buddy? So they have five cards in hand. What are the odds they have a counterspell, you think? One million. Our hand is significantly less exciting now. I think if they counter this, we just scoot. Oh, no, they discarded Worm Coil, Gideon, Plains, Plains. That seems okay. They do still have an active Jace, though. What's that? An active Jace. I'm not, I don't understand the words that you're saying. Hmm, okay. An active what? Jace. Okay, you don't have to yell. Jace!
Man, I can't believe I'm up this early, man. I was up till 7 a.m. Why would you be up till 7 a.m. if you knew? It wasn't on purpose. I started going through a, a Fallout builds hole on YouTube. Can't you just look at your phone and be like, oh, it's, I got to go to bed? It didn't work. Did I, tried, I tried to go to bed around 4 and I just didn't, I couldn't sleep. You couldn't sleep or you chose not to because you were looking at things on the internet? No, I couldn't sleep. I actually like couldn't sleep and then I was like, well, I might as well watch things on the internet until I'm tired. <laughs> and then it was 7 a.m. Oh, good. Oh, good. Let me kill this so you can put it on your mimic vat. God, do I kill the Jace or the Mimic Vat? Why not both? Because I have Woodfall Promise. Because Woodfall Promise doesn't let me kill both. But what if it did? <laughs> Dear God, Michael. You probably need to get rid of that Jace. I agree. If not, you just like bounce that and tax for a million and we die. I guess that's true, but then if they bounce it, then we get to then we get to kill the mimic bat. So they only have three cards in hand. Hmm. Oh, actually. Oh, this is gonna work out well for us. It's their turn, so the mimic bat trigger will go on first. Then our woodfall primus persist trigger will go on after that. Oh, this is going to work out well. So we're actually going to... We should get our guy back, theoretically. Before they get to... Uh... Yep, this is what we're hoping for. Triggers! <clears throat> yeah, this worked out extremely well. We got to kill their Battle Sphere and their Mimic Vat. This is why you don't concede in the face of Jace and other things. Mike, move your head. Where would it go? Move your head. Shake it. There you go. He's moving his head for you. Oh, we'll be in stone. Okay. Well, that's nice. I guess we can save Belschnickel. Gather round, kids. Belschnickel has come to town. <laughs> what is it? Impish or... What's the other one? I don't remember. Impish or admirable. That's what it is. I'll put a counter on one of my mirror tokens. I'm tempted to just kill that. I don't think you can. Why can't I? Is it, isn't it colorless? Don't tell me what to do. You're not my dad. Don't tell me what I can't do. They kind of have to throw this, throw this, blow this, throw this, blow this. Oh, they're throw like, I'll blow. attack first. Sure. Never, never give up, never surrender is the is the cube mantra. That is correct. Our Lord and Savior Belschnickel is coming down the pipe. Belschnickel is coming to town. I hope they play a Jace Vryn's Prodigy. Don't play a Geist of Saint Draft. That's fine. Because now we get to play Belschnickel. And draw two cards. Oh, find finality. Getting back two dudes seems busted. Let's do that. Let, let's do that. This kills lands too, right? Mm-hmm. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. I'm also going to just Maelstrom Pulse this so that they can't flip it and search for things like that. Yeah, we have enough mana to... Uh, yeah, let's kill this thing. They have one card. We can just keep them on the one card. But now they have two. Five, six, seven, eight. And we have ten mana, so we can actually go find into... You get Dismember? Did they forget he flies? I think they forgot he flies. You done messed up, A.A. Ron! They didn't know Demon Lord Belschnickel flew? I mean, that's the only reason I could think they attack there. Oh, they just scoop. Shame scoop. Huh. Uh. Sorry, I, I just think I'm too stupid to understand this. 
Did they just concede the whole match? They did. Wow. <laughs> what just happened, dude? They just shame conceded the whole match. Good, good games. Uh, where did the return to game? Uh, the game has ended. Okay. <laughs> what? The oh boy. Wow, they had like Jace the Mind Sculptor into Terminus with Mimic Vat, and like, I was like, I don't know how we win this game. I guess I figured it out. Oh, Michael, we just won the game. That was a good round one. That was a good first round for the cube. <laughs> it wanted to have a YouTube video. Well, it's too late, buddy. I got some bad news for you. I will play first. Oh, no green mana. I keep this hand? I don't think so. All right, sounds good. Okay. <laughs> I don't know why you asked me. Come on, man! One green mana, and we got this. We got nine sources of green in our deck. Oh, we got the matching ragavans. Dueling ragavans. Well, get rewarded. Next time we go land oracle land, and then we can't we can't lose. Add it green. <laughs> oh, you're gonna remand that, huh? Okay, that's real mature. You're basically a child in an adult's body. That's fine. Man, double blue white decks back to back. Oh, this is not a thing I care about. Oh, how much mana is that? One, two, three, four, five. So we could do it for three. Now nah, we're not there yet. Let's add a green this time. Another blue white deck, huh? I just said that. <laughs> it's like you're not even listening, Michael. You're right. Dang, that's rude. Um, would you like to pay two life? No. But I will add this thing. And then I'll play this elf. So one, two, three, four, five. Six mana next turn, so we can we can make them lose four of their four of their dudes. I'll just take two here. Copy Oracle is pretty good. We don't have any extra lands though, so it doesn't really like. Wow. That's very good. Blink history. Yeah, that's a lot of things. Oof. Haters gonna hate. Lovers gonna love. Give me all the lands. From up above. Uh, yes. This is actually a lot of mana. Oh, and it would fall on top? Sure. Let's get one green, one black. So, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten mana. So, we can nuke their hand. We can nuke their hand, or we can play Gear Hulk and Phyrexia Metamorph. And copy. And we could have actually added a blue if we were going to do that. No. Oh. Like, we gain eight if we do that. One, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And we could just nuke their hand, too. But we take a lot of damage if we do that, I think. Yeah. I think it's probably your all can copy. So, seven... We can also slime the story. What one other thing we could do is play Metamorph for three, copy the Flicker Wisp, and get rid of a Knight token, and then well, we can't blow up their hand and nuke the land because that would be a lot of mana. We don't have that much mana, guys. They have five cards in hand. That means this costs seven, and this costs five. We have one, two, three, four, six, seven, eight, and we have ten. I'd rather them just not have anything to do and be playing off the top of their deck. So we go to 16 and they get another knight, but then like we don't have to really worry about their knights because we can... And we can slime the 
the story so they never get the big the payoff. The big we I'd rather just slam their shambling vent. Uh choose target player, I will choose you. One a two three four five one, two, three, four, five. We could just do this for, nah, I don't want to do it for three though. Wow, got rid of a Kalidus, a Sorin, an Elspeth, a Gonti, and a Mull Drifter. That's pretty nuts. Let's copy Flicker Wisp. Get rid of a Knight. That seems good. And now we have eight mana on board, so we can just cast Woodfall Primus next turn. We have a blocker for this guy. Lotus Cobra is pretty much done when we have this much mana on board, so we can easily block one of their... All right, that'll do it. Turns out when you get rid of their entire hand, uh, you win the game. <laughs> Seems good. A plus Oracle. I agree. I agree. I think we're good. Yeah. Oh, bring in War and Peace over the hmm. body of mind. Because hmm? of the White Seas? Yeah. Okay. I don't even want... None of the above on you. <laughs> That's the R. Kelly, uh, Dave Chappelle mash up there. Oh, good times. I get tilted losing my entire hand as well. Is it the funky call Medina? Yes. <laughs> oh, God. Yep, yep, yep. I don't even want... You know what I'm going to say. I'm not a weirdo. It's a David Chappelle reference. <laughs> sure it is, buddy. Sure it is. So I would say all in all, our cube experience has been going well so far. This is a good hand. This is a good hand. If they went to six on the play, they're dead. Hey, look. I'm the two drop. First opponent was all about that Jace, about that Jace. Second opponent wants to wisp it. Wisp it good? What could third opponent possibly? That's a good question. Uh, da, 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 da. Is it Thorn or is it... If we play this, we can just play Nissa next turn, right? Yeah. Yeah, that's pretty good. Let's do that. I do like a third turn Nissa. I hope they don't have a blue source. I hope they try to kill this. Oh, that's good. Mm, I'm going to get another forest because I want to maximize forests for Nissa. Okay, next turn we can Woodfall Primus. Seems good. We could also mind twist our hand for four, five, six, seven. We could for eight. Yeah, that's. Oh, we can't anymore. I got actually. We can still make them discard their whole hand, which makes. Uh, yeah, let's do that. It also makes their pack wrap pretty bad. <laughs> makes it terrible. Oh, that's just gas. And conceded from the game again. Woo! <laughs> Mind Twist is a hell of a card, boys. Wow. Okay. Wow. All that time you didn't want to take that Mind Twist? And then I was like, but Mike, it's random. 
Good lord. This is gonna be the fastest cube ever. We're not even 45 minutes in and we're going into round three. Mother of God. That means my back will probably be able to stand two cube drafts. Wow. Haters wanna hate. You know how the song goes, Michael. No. Yes, you do. No. Really? No. Really? Mm hmm. Really? Is that bug flew by? I, I did. <laughs> I did. Man, that moment when your opponent goes, turn three, concede because you make them discard their entire hand. This be a two part. No, we're gonna we're gonna we can. I think we can. Uh, it's risky, but I think we can actually post this as one video. Pretty risky, sis. <laughs> oh man, if I was a little bit quicker, I might have been able to get the first trophy. You haven't seen the new card they printed. It makes the match best of one. Yeah, that felt like a best of one. Oh, my opponent was like, "No way, I'm out." I saw you mind twisting. Even though our opponent doesn't know who we are. Pretty risky, sis. That's from Connect Four. Ba -da -ba. What? Ba -da -ba. Is that the Connect Four theme song? Mm hmm Okay. Ba -da -ba. Now I'm scared I slept through Tuesday. No, it actually started today, interestingly enough. Uh one oh because our opponent conceded the match. I will play first. Um, yeah, I'm good again. Got that mind shatter, boy. William mind shatter. Oh, we do have to get a swamp with this though. That is worth noting because we yeah. can't get an overprint. Second would have been nice. Whatever, it'll just be a forest on top. Luckily, you don't really need green that bad. Mind shatter. Mike was a mind shatter once. Oh, that's sad. It's true. I'll play this guy. And then they'll kill it immediately because they're like, oh, you missed a land drop? Get wrecked, you stupid nerd. No, they didn't kill it immediately. All, everything is... Oh, Grixis, huh? Okay. Forest off the top so I can slime you. Cool. Nailed it. Well, we missed out on the Acidic Slime, but them wasting their Coligon's Command on an Elf of Deep Shadow is probably fine. Do you agree? Do you concur? That's a po boy. I just made shrimp and wow. sub. <laughs> That's actually hilarious. It's <laughs> pretty good. I'm a fan of that. God, Reflecting Pool is such a good land. Okay, Belschnickel, take it easy. We could make them discard two cards randomly. They could be their two best cards in hand. We could. Nothing really good here, though. Factor Fiction? No, that's not legal and modern. Venser. Oh, you're just going to bounce my land. That's mature. That means lucky. Oh, I see. That's that's in the cube, I guess. Well then. 
Man, I wish this was a Rakdos return now. Hmm. Attacking that Ral. Rally McZally. I feel like we're we're fighting uphill here, but land gets us acidic slime and then another land gets us bells and locks, so. It's not bad. Hey, how's your back doing over there? You can also bring like a pillow, would that help? Like put behind your little back? Put a little pillow back there? No, that wouldn't help. Ain't no pillow back, girl. That's from Gwen Stefani. Hmm. How old is that song now? I bet there's people in the don't chat who are up. like, I don't even know what that. Don't look it up, you said? Don't look it up. Uh, 2004? That song is 14 years old? Mm-hmm. Oh, God. Oh, that's painful to, to realize. You think that song holds up? It's still catchy. I guess. He roasted it. It's fine. It's two for one. Oh. Just mono, uh... Mono planeswalkers up in here. Well, we could make them lose three of their cards, but then they have these two guys. All of Gwen Stefani holds up. Change my mind. Huh. Huh. Oh. That's fair. B A N A N A S. Like we keep we're keeping them off red mana, which is nice, but they also have two planeswalkers on the board. Um That's fine. I mean, they take the Mana Confluence Vampire Nighthawk to hand, obviously. Yeah, I don't know, maybe it was two lands Vampire Nighthawk, but I don't I didn't really care about the Vampire Nighthawk, I guess. Oh, they just have a mountain anyway. Yep, alright, so we know they have Confluence in hand. Removal spell, one time. Bananas, Mike's coffee is bananas. Mike's Frappuccinos are bananas. Oh, you're just going to Vendillion click us. Well, that's pretty cool. You're a cool dude. You're a Vendillion clicking dude. Targeting himself? That's interesting. No, they're targeting us. Oh, okay. I just thought because the arrow pointed to his... Yeah, but then there's this one pointing to us. Oh, okay. I don't know the difference. This one's a crosshair, this one's a target. I guess this is where it's coming from, and this is where it's going. Where does it come from? Just keep... What did you say to me? I said this is cube. This is cube! That's from uh, 360. Three, 300? 300. <laughs> 360. I thought they went all the way No around. scope. <laughs> Headshot. Oh, Jesus. All right, come on, let's go. Hurry up, man. God. What'd they take? Belschnickel? 
Yeah, that's just a mind shadow. That's interesting. That is interesting. I wish the sequel to 300 Qual was 302. Wow. I think we just mind shatter here. <sighs> Got rid of four lands. Wow. Mike, feeling any better? Unfortunately, no. He's really holding up, though. He's a trooper. He's just getting used to this now. This is just how he lives. <laughs> it feels like it. I bet they have one card left in hand. I bet it was not one of these four lands that they discarded. It's sad. We do get to play Nissa and then flip Nissa, which is nice. And then we can also play Phyrexian Arena. This Ral Zarek is really problematic. They yep. took a card better than Is It Charm. That's pretty good. Ral Zarek is basically just red green Teferi. Red green, you say? Yep, red blue is what I meant. <laughs> We're doing good. Yeah, you know, the movie 360, sometimes I watch it when I'm playing Red Green Teferi. Nice. Yeah. It's just a traditional line. I have no idea how to pronounce that, unfortunately. Architectus Nope, ducks. that's what I thought, too. Either way, thank you for the sub. Really appreciate it. Oh, a Tassiger and a mana to activate a Tassiger. Access to a pool under my back is fucked. Someone helps the stiffness go away. Do not have access to a pool currently. You should get it. You should get pool access. Paxis, if you will. That's pool access. It's from the French. Architeuthis ducks? Okay. Alright, well, we're just done here. Like, you, you, you managed to keep Dismember and Tassiger, so you hit one of them off of this, you drew the other, so... Whatever. What can you do? Either way, Archie is Dust, thank you so much for the, for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Latin for giant squid, apparently. Your mother's Latin for giant squid. Oh my god, Roasted. Ha. <sighs> that didn't work. Really? I tried to lean forward. It was a bad idea. Pretty sure you're a bad idea. Wow. God, I'm just messed up, man. You know what else is messed up? No. You. Yeah, you're right. Got him again. Oh, my God. He's got a fail. I think we just submit. Do we? Yeah. Do we? Yes. I kind of like adding this Liliana. Like, they want to play a Planeswalker game. How much would it cost Mike to see the doctor and treat his back? Um, it depends on what's wrong with it. <laughs> yeah, it really depends. Sarcastron, thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back. Cube, cube, cube. Kuba. Kuba Gooding Jr. I don't know what to take out, though. Maybe a Noxious Gear Hulk for Liliana. Mm, I guess. Where did you come from, Cotton Eye Joe? Why oh, is this song stuck in my head? I don't know. I will play first. I will keep this hand. And I'm just going to hope to ride this sword to victory. Turn two sword. Can't deal with it. Try the bend and snap from Legally Blonde. So now we get to equip this, and if they try to kill it, we can tap this and the swamp, or the, uh, I guess the forest, to play Thorn Lieutenant. So that's good.
Fascinating. Oh, wow. We connect. Oh, that's gas. Oh, we hit a cryptic command? Anger of the gods. That's, that's nice to hit. Repeal. Is it charm? Yep. That was okay. Look, it's a Mike Beeramid. <laughs> wow. Oh, boy. <clears throat> amazing. It is amazing. You're correct. Can you tell me something? What do you want to know? Where did you come from? Where did you go? My name ain't Cotton Eye Joe. We're all <clears throat> Cotton Eye Joe's here. <clears throat> We all cotton die gin down here. Cotton die gin down here? <laughs> what, does that, what does that even mean? Oh. oh my god. Sort of, sort of body mind is pro blue, pro green, and uh, when it when it deals damage, you get a two two wolf, and they mill for ten. Oh, how nice! Lucky, 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 lucky. Well, there's still a 13. And we still got to mill 10, so I guess that's something. Sweltering sun. Oh my god, dude. Come on. I'm actually going to save this. Because if we don't hit a land next turn, we can still play Bells and Lock. But if we hit a land next turn and this guy gets killed, we can also play Bells and Lock. So, kind of a... Kind of a coin flip there, I think. How does he still have six cards in his hand? Gosh. Oh, my Ral Zarek every game. <clears throat> yep, figured you'd do that. Okay, well, that's a thing, I guess. So now they just have one card in a Ral Zarek, which is still pretty good. Wow, Remand, Vraska's Contempt, Dismember. <laughs> just mono removal dot deck over here. Wow. That cat is loud. Good luck seeing the deck, considering this is a modern cube. However, I do appreciate your moxie. That cat is real loud. You're right. Any land for this Bells and Lock. One time. I mean, I bet they just... They're probably just going to Vendillion click us here. Oh my god, you had two cards. Wow. <clears throat> How many things have I called? I called the Sweltering Suns, I called this. Oh, Jesus. You're wondering why Bells and Lock, but you weren't wondering why Sword of Body and Mind, or Elves of Deep Shadow, or Thorn Loot, <laughs> or any of these other cards. Well. Sometimes.
Just have three cards in their hand. It's pretty ridiculous. <laughs> oh, God. We just have an answer to everything we've ever done. That was actually a great hit. The problem is if we negative her and make a, an Ashaya, they're just going to kill it with Rally Zally. And then they're going to attack us with Creeping Tarpet to kill her. So I guess we have to go up here. Hey, that's pretty good. Belschnickel. Kagrin, thank you so much for the sub. Really appreciate it. Welcome, welcome. Thank you for saying negative her? Why? Why? Oh. Oh, I see. Instead of the, uh, uh, the, the much less, uh, audibly friendly neg her. Which, uh, does not have a, uh, it doesn't say, it doesn't have a good sound on the ears when you say it quickly. Oh, now I understand. Yeah. They only have they have nine cards left in their deck. That's fascinating. Oh, I see. Well then, old Splashyock. Well, all right, it's fine, I guess. Man, my kingdom for a way to kill this tar pit right now. A six line would be nice. That is no acidic slime. We could far seek. Maximize our chance of hitting something better, but we'll fall promise. Does that do anything? Not really. It's not even going to do anything. They're just going to neg Ral to kill Demon Lord, Creeping Tarpet to kill Nyssa, and then we're basically stuck with nothing on board. I guess we can find Finality to get Bells and Lock and Thorn Lieutenant back. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3. We're one mana shy of casting both, though. Man, why Kirby and Tarpet gotta be two colors? I do not understand. Dang. What? You're right. It's two colors. They'll never die. <laughs> that which is two colors may never die. It's basically like the... Uh, it's basically House Greyjoy, but... You know. Different. Similar, but different, you know? What did they hit? They got a metamorph here? That's pretty good. Now they can just copy our bells and lock. Seems good. Where did you come from, Cotton? I'm Mike. I've been so a long time ago. Yep. We have Maelstrom Pulse and Assassin's Trophy and uh... Woodfall Primus in the deck that can all kill Ashiok. So, it, you know, we're kind of... Yeah, there we go. See, now we're talking. They don't have Remand. They don't have Cryptic Command. Both of those are in your graveyard. They could have Venser. Nope, that guy's in the graveyard, too. Okay. Seems good. That was actually a great hit, because now they can't Woodfall. They can't... They can't... How do they even kill this? If they want to... Is it... They can't even Ral to kill this. So if they want to go to like five cards in their deck, they can use Ral and kill this guy, but... Oh, wow. You're going to go get a land when you have seven... Oh, my God. A bold strategy, Cotton. 
It's a bold strategy, Cotton. Let's see if it pays off for him. Oh, they're just gonna... Okay, well that was a... I don't know what's going on here. That's a... That's another bold strategy, we'll say. They're at five cards. Yikes. I don't know I don't know if we can win this game. They probably have some shenanigans in their deck that we haven't seen. But how many lands is this? One, two, three. Oh, they just they just couldn't wow. save the game. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen. So there were two lands in here. Ani's Joker, thank you so much for the resub. Welcome back, buddy. I'm pretty sure you've been a sub before. Wow, today's sub count is only three? That doesn't seem correct at all. More like 30. Okay. 30. So. Wow. I actually like Mana Gorge or Hydra. This is like an early threat? Well, it dodges all of their like stupid stuff. Like if they want to burn it out, apparently eventually it just gets too big. Okay. Okay. Let me cut for it. I don't know. But I also kind of like Sword of War and Peace too. Really? Well, yeah, because they have Sweltering Suns and Anger of the Gods and Roast and Kolagon's Command. Oh, true, yeah. Like, they're okay. a bunch of nonsense. Let's do it. We have to make some... Why is that cat so loud right now? We probably swap out the swords. I think Sword of Body Mind is very, very good, especially if they're drawing so many cards. I like both swords, to be honest. Okay. Let me cut Frix now. Oh, Frixian Arena seems good, too. Ultimate Price? Ultimate Price kills, yeah. like, two things. God, he's so loud, dude. That morph might never be that great here. Really? They don't have a lot of things to copy. I mean, copying Venser or... Yeah, I guess that might be true. I wonder if Tarmogoyf's good here. Could just be huge. Could just be a 4-5. Yeah. I think we can submit like this. This seems fine. I like Silumgar's command to uh, destroy a Planeswalker, actually. I wonder if that's worth adding a blue. Missing our mana base, though? I don't know. I mean, how many ways? We have Sakura Tribal, mm. Lotus Cobra, Farseek, and Search for Tomorrow to get a blue. So one blue is actually five blue sources. That's a good point. I could see cutting the Liliana Death Magistrate. I don't think she's that good either. Death Magistrate? Yeah. Magistrate? Magister? Mag? Mag? Ma we'll go with Majesty. Okay. All I'll right. go with Goo 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 Goo. I'll go with Goo 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 Goo. My spine is telling me no. But? But my spine's <laughs> telling me no. <laughs> All right, we're going to add one island. God, Sultai always. You got to cut another land. Oh, we're not. Why? I guess we can 41 it. Boy, I 41 it every day. See? Look at this, 41. Beautiful. It's all green. This hand is actually pretty good. Yeah, but if we don't, it's bad. You're right. Probably a mole. Of course you kept it. <laughs> we got two turns. It's not a big deal, right? God, we're so good. <laughs> Maybe you are. Rewarded. Oof. Um, I think it's just Snake Man here. Yeah, it's a guaranteed hit. Nailed it. Billy, how was your little call, buddy? I'm trying to figure out how to donate. I went through a rough time and I watched a lot of your videos and I'm doing better now, so I like to show. That would be awesome, dude. Unused Joker, you can check out the links below or um, I think there's actually a link, right? There you go. There's a link for you. Are they going to remand this guy? That'd be pretty funny, right? I'm going to get a Sacred Foundry. Oh, wow. This is aggressive. Essence Scatter? Sure. You got it. This guy's a 3-4 already. It dodges both of their 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 things. Let's add a green. 
and play Goyf. So they can roast this guy, but they can't kill this as well, I assume. I guess they probably still can. They got infinite removal. Their deck is just all removal all the time. This is also nice to have. We have two Planeswalker removal spells against their Planeswalker heavy deck. The important thing is I'm not officially free to watch. That is the important thing. You are correct. Unease Joker. Also glad to hear I got you through some tough times, man. I really appreciate you saying so. I'm glad I could help. As, uh, you know... Little, as little as I could. I'm glad I could help. Get rid of Doom Whisper here. We're not that close to getting that guy back. If we hit a black, we can play Arena. Which keeps us in this game, I think. I'll roast this guy. I have all the answers at all time. Oh, uh, just interesting. Interesting. Oh, wow. Um, yikes. Um, I'll put Cryptic Command by itself. I actually want to remember what this card does because I kind of forget sometimes. So I'm going to do this, Drowby. Bring you over here. And we'll hit OK. I think Cryptic Command is stronger than Solomgar's Command. I would agree with that. Yeah, and I'm not going to give you two spells, and I'm not going to give you the Steam Vents and the Stronger card, so it seems like the only natural option. I showed your drunk mic stream to the boyfriend the other day, and he was in tears. He was laughing so hard he wanted to let you know that if he ever hits the lotto, that he would make sure you'd always be funded in your room and paid every month for forever. <laughs> wow. <laughs> That's hilarious. I accept this offer. Oh, that was a great draw, because now we can get this in under uh, the Silumgar's command, which did they take? What did they take? Cryptic Command. Oh, they took just the command. Wow, that's pretty good. Especially because we get to kill this Jace. That's... Wow, that was great. So they basically traded a Jace for a Cryptic Command. Now it's a 4-5? Alright, cool. Well, I guess I don't need the Silumgar's Command up anymore. And we get to just draw two cards forever. That seems good. Uh... So we're going to play this, and they're going to Cryptic Command it, right? Maybe they won't. Maybe they will. I don't think they Cryptic Command bounce. Maybe attack first, even though it lets, we miss a sword trigger, but... They could also Cryptic Command bounce the Tarmogoyf, but that doesn't seem good at all. Correct. This is Cube Austin. Hmm. Fascinating. We can keep Assassin's Trophy. I don't know if that matters, though. That's what I'm thinking. Yeah, I don't think two damage hurts us that much here. But having the Assassin's Trophy up is pretty good. <sighs> It's just cryptic, like, bounce for Exine Arena. Vraska's Contempt. Sure. I like that they took four points off that first. That was nice. We do need some threats, though. Especially when we know they have Cryptic Command here. However, we're drawing two cards a turn. So. Shrug. Mm, nothing yet. Yeah, Tarmogoyf is actually pretty sizable. Usually it's not great in the cubes, but it was pretty okay here. <laughs> Man, electrolyzing the face is just, I'm just like, okay, cool. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> yes. I meant drawing two lands a turn. That is uh, unfortunately what I meant. The secret mode. What, the two lands a turn? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's how it works. I mean, they can't really play anything here without us going ham on it. I'm going to play a Rally Zally. Like you do. I will let you choose. They did play a land this turn, right? No, not yet. Sure. All right, now is our time. One turn away from that dude, and now they get to put up Cryptic Command. Great. Well, this has been an unfortunate turn of events. Mike, if you could only speak one word for an entire day, what would it be? Hodor. <laughs> I feel like someone beat you to that, though. Hodor was the one who beat you to it. Did you get a haircut? No. Did you want one? No. Okay. Good talk. I got really confused on why the Time Spiral Draft auto-played in, into the middle of a cube draft and 30 minutes later and I realized it was because I switched from YouTube to Twitch. Wow, that's actually hilarious. Morgan, you gotta get it together. So I don't want to actually play this because it's very, very good. So I'm gonna cast this instead. And uh, eventually, you know, eventually I'm just gonna stop drawing lands. That's what I so think. So you think. That is what I think, you're correct. So they go one, two, three, activate, and then one. They can't cryptic command as well, which is nice. They only have five minutes left to R15. Wow, that is Mike, a... is. Mike, is your back feeling better? No. In fact, it hurts right now. Oh, that was a nice hit. Uh, so four, five, seven, eight, nine, ten. We need 13 for these two. Guess I'm just going to keep passing. Return a permanent. To its owner's hand. Destroy a planeswalker. Yeah, that card's great. I think hoping he doesn't have another island and assassin trophy a land is real loose. What do you mean? Like if we were to like assassin's trophy the Oh yeah, and then, just, pit, then hope, hope he doesn't, he doesn't have, have a basic. No, he's yeah. definitely got a third a second basic island. Okay, now we're drawing things. The big mully dully. Oh, all right. Well, we're, we know we're drawing that, I guess. He's really holding out on the cryptic. He really is holding out on the cryptic. I'm actually going to equip this. Equip, equip this. Uh, so we're going to go green, green. One, two, three, four. We can, we can actually Sylmgar's command if they try to do any, any shenanigans. We can actually bounce the creeping tarp at EOT, but they don't have any other targets, right? Like, there's no other non-creature spell to target, there's no creature to give neg 3-2, and there's no planeswalker to destroy, so. Uh-oh. Well, it's not cryptic. Cycling sweltering suns, sure. Oh, they got 420, blaze it. 420, sweltering suns it. Oh, what up, McGimp? It's your boy, McGimp. Um, I think I'm actually going to Silmgar's command this and then bounce your Creeping Tarpet so you don't have Cryptic Command mana. Uh, wait, is this, you choose two? Yeah, you choose two, right? Counter target spell, return a permanent to Sonar's hand, yeah. Bird, bird, bird. Four, eight, one, two, three. I mean, you have to have Remand here, right? If he doesn't, he's in a pretty bad spot. And they do. <laughs> they never don't have it. It's un it's incredible. I've never seen a, a player that never didn't have it more frequently. Like, like as long as they can definitely cute. As long as they have, they have to win in like ten turns, right? So people, I love people asking if this is cube. It's pretty hilarious. Like this is definitely not a modern deck. 
Although mm-hmm. although it does say modern in the I'm gonna say and cube drafts because there will be no other type now that the cube is live. Is this loss? Hugh, <laughs> Hugh, Hugh, Hugh. That's a meme. I know. Okay. Well, I just wanted to make sure you know. It says modern salt type, but you can pretty much assume I'm not going to be playing like. You know, you know, maybe not. That's fine. Whatever. It also says drafts, <laughs> but I'm not going to argue with you. Yeah, that's what I mean. Like, this does look like something I could probably put together, but I don't think I'm going to be playing, like... I don't know. Is he tapping out? Oh, wow. Oh, that's aggressive. Well, now our, our clock is significantly drained. Um, Primus, kill his creeping tar pit? Yeah, we have to now. I also want to kind of get rid of our own uh, this. We could do that next turn. I could do it this turn. I think we're going to have to do it this turn. Our hand is actually very good, all things considered. Oh, cool. Yeah, some kind of bull or bird. All right. Thank you guys so much for watching. Really appreciate it. Slam those like and subscribe buttons. Check me out on Twitch, Patreon, and meundies.com slash Frank Lepore. You can find the links in the description below. Really appreciate all the support. Again, thank you so much. Uh, really nice to hit that higher Twitch tier. And uh, thank you guys for that. Really appreciate it. I'll see you guys next time. And uh, thanks for watching.